This is the Pixis prototype board. It's EEPROM has not yet been formatted, so we can step through the entire initial setup process. As you can see, here's the setup window dialog. It's got object oriented buttons. So if I press this down, it does a click for me. This has been mapped to a full QWERTY keyboard. Um, much like a cell phone, if you do, um, this is ABC. So if we do A, B, C, uh, it also has a timeout. So if we were to do D, E, and then you can see it's timed out and said, okay, you're done entering things now. I'm going to hit the tab button here. Focus on the next control, which is the OK button, and click that down. It's going to format the uh, EEPROM hard drive. It sets in a custom file system called the PFAT, and uh, it's it's set as a 8.3 file system. Okay, now that we formatted the EEPROM hard drive, we're going to start it back up. It'll be a lot faster this time since it doesn't have to format. Again, we have the SD card out, so it'll come up and tell us no card. And this is what our desktop looks like. You can go ahead and navigate around with the arrow keys. We're going to start with the, uh, the USD finder here. And since we don't have a card in, it's going to give us a retry cancel dialog. What we're going to do is we're going to just take this uh, SD card here and pop it right in. and tell it to retry, which is the default option. And there we can see the images. Now an improvement over the last version of Pixis is not only does it um, load the images a lot faster, uh, initially it could load a full screen image in 59 seconds, now it can do it in 19.9. Uh, so we'll start off with this small one. Really quick, tiny picture here. Um, Here's the other thing, it can also do non-320 by 240 images. This is actually uh, 126 or something like that. And uh, once it's done loading, you just press any key to exit out. And then we'll load up a bigger one here. It automatically centers the image for you. And again, when we're done, we just press any key. Um, now, when we're inside of a program and we want to exit, we're going to hit the function key here, and then select, and that'll exit us out. And there we have the Pixis prototype.